South Korea and Russia took part in collaborative arts and culture projects to celebrate 30 years of diplomatic relations between the two countries. The nation's culture ministry has announced that the resulting videos can now be seen on the program's official YouTube channel. Kim chung has more. Back in 2018, Russia and South Korea announced 2020 to 2021 as the year of cultural exchanges between the two countries in commemoration of the 30th anniversary of diplomatic relations. And to expand collaboration in the arts and culture sectors, the Korea-Russia Young Arts Project was formed, inviting university students from both countries to work together on certain projects. 40 students were picked to take part in the program, 14 from South Korea and 26 from Russia, for three categories, music, theater, and dance. From April 2021, the students met online twice per month with professional mentors to create work, which has been showcased on the program's official YouTube channel. In the music category, students performed Bach's Concerto for three pianos in D minor and a creative piece called Immortal Flowers, played in a unique collaboration online due to the pandemic. For dance, two pieces were performed where students from each country created moves for music composed by the other country. And for theater, students performed a new theatrical piece named Cafe Contrabanda Club, based on the theme of communication being used as a way of helping those fighting loneliness, especially amid the prolonged pandemic. South Korea's culture ministry will count the number of YouTube likes on each video until August 18th, and together with online survey results, we'll pick the best project out of the three. Kim Chang-ha, Arirang News.